All right, all righty, my friends. What do we got going on today? We got a Whopper with cheese. We got another Whopper with cheese. They're two for six. Let me show you. You can get a Whopper and a Whopper. They're two for six, but with the cheese, they added, see, it's two for six right here. Two Whoppers for $6. The cheese is, what, 50 cents a piece. So that makes it seven dollars plus tax seven sixty seven, and we're going to do a review on the Whopper and the cheer wine at the same time. Can you smell what your boy the big O's getting ready to eat from your neck of the woods? Now that's what I'm talking about. What's on the Whopper? Beef patty, cheese. Looks like two uh, onion slices of onion. We got two tomatoes. We got mayo and we got lettuce. Now you know the rest of the story. No, we're not Paul Harvey and cheer wine. Is out of North Carolina, one of my favorite drinks. It's a soda. Uh, which, you know, I actually did a, a review on Cheerwine, what, a couple days ago? But I'm going to do another re talk about it anyway. It's out of uh, North Carolina, I think, if I'm not mistaken, Goldsboro. I mean, uh, Greensboro, North Carolina. And let me see if this one says where this one's from. It doesn't say right here on the side. But they're out of North Carolina. That's where they originated from. They're only sold in the southeastern United States, primarily in Tennessee, Virginia, and Kentucky, and maybe a few other places, but mainly around the Virginia, Kentucky, Tennessee area. So without further ado, let's bite into this Whopper. I'm going to put this on my tripod. I'm at my in-law's house. Isn't this beautiful? It's been about 74 degrees today. But, you know, we had a, a warm day. We got a cold front coming in. Right around the corner. It's beautiful. All right. We'll talk about nature later, but I love filming over here, and you can see why. You can see why. So let's get over here and let's do the review. Don't go nowhere. It's the big old show. Two whoppers for six will do the trick. All right, without further ado, I'll make sure it's recording. It appears it's recording. So let me turn the camera around. Let's do a review. Can you smell what your boy the big O's eating from your neck of the woods? Now that's what I'm talking about right here on the big O show. <sighs> Let's bite into her. Mmm. That tomato's good. A lot of times when you get burgers or sandwiches from restaurants, the tomatoes are half ripe. This tomato is pretty good wrap. It's decent, decently wrapped. The burger tastes good. The bun's moist. The bun's moist. How about that beef? Can you smell what your boy the big O's eating from your neck of the woods? Look at that beef with that piece of cheddar cheese on top. That's what I'm talking about. It's good. I mean, two for six, you can't beat this with a stick. If everybody knows beef, you know, like hamburgers, ground beef, steaks, all those things are high right now. Very high, along with <clears throat> the food prices are keep going up. It's cheaper to buy food at a restaurant than it is to buy it and carry it home and cook it. But there's nothing like home cooking, cooked meals, correct? Do you like Whoppers? Leave it in the comments down below. I do. My three favorite burgers. Pals, a big pal with cheese, which is a restaurant right here in lovely Kingsport, Tennessee. Virginia and Tennessee. A big pal with cheese, a Whopper, and a Dave's Double or Dave's Single from Wendy's. Those are my three favorite hamburgers. Now you know the rest of the story. Can you smell what your boy Big O was eating from your neck of the woods? That's that what I'm talking about. Mmm. This burger came right here on South Zombie and Dennis Highway. When I get to Whoppers there, especially in the daytime, they are always better than the other Burger Kings. Everything tastes fresh on here. On my food rating scale from 0 to 10, what will I give it? I give it an 8. It's not as good as a big pound of cheese, but I'm telling you, this is off the chain. The beef's good. It's moist. You can taste that charbroiled flavor because... They cut the Whoppers. 
the beef on a broiler. And a broiler, all a broiler is, all a broiler, broiler is, I'm talking about my mouth, a broiler is nothing but a wire rack that goes over fire. You put the burgers on one side, they go with the fire and come out the other side. I used to work at Burger King part-time growing up. And I worked there in 99 part-time to make extra money. And electrical work most of my life. But anyway, the mayo's good, the beef's good, the, the tomato's good. The bun with the sesame seeds is very good. Do you like Whoppers? Please leave it in the comments. And I'm not going to worry about drinking this right here, but I'm telling you, I've got a pop of top. I don't have a bottle opener out here. The cheer wine gets a 10. My food rating scale goes from zero to 10. The higher the number, the better the food. This cheer wine gets a 10. It's got a great cherry flavor. It's got a lot of carbonation and I love, love it. That carbonation, that fizz, this thing has a lot of life to it. I love this. They, they come from North Carolina and they sell them in North Carolina, Tennessee, and I know Virginia, I think Kentucky. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe as always. I hope everyone's having a wonderful day on this Super Sunday. Just look at that Whopper. Can you smell what your boy the big O's eating from your neck of the woods? And that's what I'm talking about. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up, please. Leave it in the comments. Do you like Whoppers? Two for six. You can't beat it with a stick. 50 cents for a slice of cheese. That's a great deal. Thanks for watching the Big O Show. Give me a thumbs up, comment, share my videos. Help me to be successful in life on my YouTube channel. Love all my viewers, my friends, my subscribers. I'll see you in the next video. Big O's out with a shout. Mountain life right here in East Tennessee. This is those chimes. Nice little breeze blowing, about 75 degrees. See you in the next video. My friends.